hey guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to use media fire step by step so if you want to learn how to use media fire watch this video carefully to the end so that i can learn how to do that so the first thing you need to do is open your browser and search for mediafire.com so just search for mediafire so i'm going to show you how to create free accounts so just click on sign up at the top right corner and once you click on sign up you need to select the plan that you want so we are going to go with the free plan which is basic so they are going to give us free 10 gig of storage so you can only upload file that is up to 10 gig so just click on get basic and once you click on it they are going to ask you for some things to create accounts so they are going to ask for your first name last name email password and once you have input all that just click on i have read and agree to privacy policy and you need to solve a capture so once you have done all that just click on create account and continue so you have a, so i have an account already so i'm just going to click on login and i'm going to log into my account so let me put my password so guys can you see that's logged in successfully so once you create an account you are going to see something like this just click on this profile icon right here and you need to click on my files so yes this is where you are going to upload file and share it to your friends so once you click on my files you need to wait for this to load so if you want to upload a new file just click on this upload icon so that's the very first option so just click on it and you need to tap anywhere so once you tap anywhere you are going to see choose file or take photo or photo library so i'm just going to go with choose file so you can select any type of file zip file pdf any type of file so just select it and you need to click on open so i'm just going to look for a picture and i'm going to use it so let's use this picture so once you select the picture just click on open and it's going to start uploading immediately so you need to wait for the file to finish uploading before you copy the link so you guys can you see that's upload successfully so you can now click on copy link and you can share the link to your friends so you can also click on share and it's going to show you the link and you can also share it to your facebook twitter email so just copy the link and paste the link anywhere so once you upload the file you are going to see all your files right here so if you want to delete it you can just click on the three dots in front of it and you're going to see different options so you can set it to one time link you can copy the link you can download it you can move it to another folder you can copy the file you can rename it you can add description and you can add password to it so if you want to protect it so you can also delete it by clicking on move to trash so if you want to search for a file in your media fire account can just use this search icon if you have a lot of files in your mediafire account so if you want to create a folder so if you want to send like two or three files to someone at once with one link you can just create a folder and add it to the folder so i'm going to add some file to my photos folder so just click on the three dots and you need to click on move to so just select the folder and click on move here so it is very easy guys so you can do this for a lot of file so let's click on move to photos and click on move here so you can just copy the link to the folder and share it at once so you can just click on copy link and share the folder link at once instead of sharing the files one after the other so if you want to edit anything or if you want to subscribe to the premium just click on these three lines at the top right corner and you're going to see so you are going to see accounts so just click on account and once you click on account it's going to load for a few seconds so if you want to subscribe to the premium you are going to see so you are going to see account and billing so that's where you are going to upgrade your account so you are going to see the storage that you have used so guys can you see out of 10 gig i have used 3.38 so just check through this place and you are going to see what you want so it's very easy to use so let's stop here so if you have any question drop it in the comments down below and i'm going to reply to your comments thanks for watching guys don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel